Welcome to Nari Sakhi to healthy kids food. I am Gusha. Oh. I am Gusha. So let's go ahead and make healthy kids dosa. The ingredients are half cup rice, one fourth cup urad dal, one tablespoon chana dal, one teaspoon fenugreek seeds, one teaspoon cumin seeds, salt, pinch of turmeric, oil, ghee or you can use vegan butter. So let's start by soaking the rice. I have taken brown rice. It's more healthier. You can take white rice if you have. Urad dal and chana dal. Soak it in enough water and you can rinse it if you want. Uh, this is uh, organic so it is uh, chemical free and fertilizer free. Uh, take uh, cumin seeds and fenugreek seeds, methi seeds. Now this water I'm going to use it for grinding so make sure they are clean. So soaks fenugreek seeds and uh, cumin seeds separately for about uh, six to seven hours and preferably keep it in a warm place at room temperature after six to seven hours of soaking usually I soak it at night so in the morning it's ready for breakfast uh, this is what I have now I'm going to grind all this together and you can clean the rice and dal and drain the water I just use my hand to clean it very nicely and the water which is there you can use it as a hair rinse or you can use it to water the plants because it has nutrients I'm going to use very little water for grinding so grind all this together to a fine paste and this is what I have it's thick so I'm, I'm going to add water it should not be too thick or too watery so add some a little bit of water to make it the right consistency Add some salt if you don't uh, give uh, salt to your children you can skip salt I had very little salt and a little bit of water to make it the right consistency and I'm going to add turmeric turmeric gives nice color to dosa and it is also good for health so I try to include uh, turmeric in the food so add a pinch of turmeric and stir it it's a right consistency it's not too thick or not too watery and we don't need to ferment it we can uh, make dosa right away so take a pan you can take um, ghee vegan butter or oil uh, make keep it on a medium flame and our dosa should be now ready to be made. You can take about two ladles and spread it a little bit because we don't want it too thick or too thin. Uh, this is the right uh, thickness. I try to make it a softer version you can make it crispy by making it thin whatever your children like uh, my baby likes a um, little bit soft and thick and you can check in between if it's done it will take about two to three minutes on one side so it's not done just uh, check it on the side if it's leaving the side that means it's done it's not done so I'm going to keep it I just opened it to show you how to check if it's done So now it looks like it's done. So we are going to again check on the sides. Yes, it, it is leaving the sides on all the sides. So it is done. Flip it over. It's nice and golden. Little bit crusty but soft. On the other side it won't take much time. So I'm going to keep it covered for another one or two minutes because it will be cooked on the other side very quickly. 
and this is what I have on both sides nice and golden color and it's ready to be served I'm going to show you both the sides so it's nice golden and soft and you can serve this with the jaggery if you like the sweeter version for breakfast just sprinkle the jaggery because jaggery is a healthier version of uh, sugar so just sprinkle some jaggery when it's hot uh, so it will be melted just right and let's uh, test our dosa how it's become You can serve this with sambar, vegetables or with chutney or with jaggery for breakfast. It's healthy, loaded with nutrients, good carbs and it, it can be for also for lunch, for lunch menu. So try this healthy dosa and let me know in your comments if your children like it and if you have any questions about the preparation. Thank you for watching and we'll see you soon in the next episode.